Greetings, everyone, and welcome to our Kickstarter. We're the group known as Kaiju 5, and what we're trying to build today is a fiberglass airsofting cosplay mask, um, which you can see uh, our engineer in charge, <laughs> Mr. Daniel Escobedo, is wearing for you. Um, this is our prototype, aka our master mold, that we've started off as far as with the funds that we have. Uh, the reason why we're doing our Kickstarter right now is pretty much to help mass produce these so we could get them out easier, faster, and a lot more cheaper than pretty much what we're <laughs> budgeting for right now. Um, so far, we're only asking for a thousand. Uh, that's going to make about 10 uh, fiberglass molds for us, uh, mass at least. And so far, this is going to be our main design. Uh, granted, of course, the coloring scheme will be different, uh, especially if you get one of our rewards, which uh, starting at 150, I believe is going to be our early birds um, to get a jump on these uh, helmets pretty much. We're expecting to have them done in March. Um, we also have other rewards which for lower tiers which starting at $20 you'll get a nice soda can flower made by our engineer <laughs> in the house pretty much. Um, and then they'll go up from there as you'll see below. We also have a few our highest level which you'll see is about 225 that's just for a, you know a standard one but like I said we do have our early birds down below. Um, we're expecting to try to get these out by March of 2016. We'll be running this for, of course, 30 days, as you'll see the timer to our left. But we're hoping to get these out there because it's very unique, very cool, <laughs> especially uh, since we live in Southern California area. We're very Mexican-oriented, which you can see by our skin color. <laughs> <laughs> but, you know, we like... The reason why he made this design is for Aztec uh, base, pretty much. So he has plans of other designs, other animals, other tigers, um, other, you know, wolves, especially. That's going to be our next design, most likely. But pretty much we're going to have a lot of open areas. Um, our main part, which you'll see in a couple of diagrams, we'll splice in. <laughs> we're thinking about putting LEDs in the light area, in the eyes area, as well as the, we're thinking about adding a cooling system inside. Because if you wear a full body, you know, helmet, it gets hot very quickly, especially Southern California. But we're hoping to try to integrate a nice cooling system in it, as well as we'll be replacing half of the mesh on top with a glass um, protective lens for air softening. We also have plans if we get funded successfully and we start, you know, mass producing on a greater scale of probably making a paintball version, as well as a detachable mask version. Uh, but right now, pretty much this will be the main one, as well as you'll see in our diagram, of course, what we're expecting to do but we hope to get your support we hope to get these going most likely if we could get as much as you know meet our goal we could probably push these out even before you know our rough estimate of when we're gonna start started pretty much in march that's what we're hoping to start shipping some out and start making them by the end of the year and get them ready to go for the people that back us up but we hope you guys will back us i hope this is a design that you guys are interested in and we hope to make more.